All right, for this week on PSC 2010, you get to see heaven on one side of me because you can't see anything over here. Wow. We're doing Great and Hate Week, which is basically you either say, you say things that you love in one category and things that you would be totally okay if they never happened to you again. And sports. Best sport, hands down, no questions asked, baseball. I'm, I'm your all-American girl. Uh, worst sport. <laughs> I was gonna say hurling. Curling, I don't get it. It doesn't make sense to me. Like, everything else makes sense. Soccer makes sense. Football makes sense. You know, rugby makes sense. Freaking bowling makes sense. I, I don't get curling. I don't understand it. And it's a deep sweep. Like, that's a woman's game. Weather. There's, there's two options for this. There is like 72 and partly cloudy with a nice breeze and then number two for that is thunderstorm like big massive shake your house make you pee your pants kind of thunderstorm because i love that that's my favorite thing in the entire world the worst type of weather is kind of what we have right now because it's like it's like 58 and it's gray out. Like, it's not even raining. It's just gray and gross, and I don't like it. Best smell right before rain. Hands down. Worst smell. This is just for me, because it sucked. There's some smell. I don't even know what the smell is, to be completely honest with you. But every time I smell it, and I keep smelling it, I don't know how. It's, like, haunting me. But, um, it smells like the hospital when I was in the hospital and it drives me nuts like it's it I'm not you know walking around in hospitals all the time so I don't know why I keep smelling it but like I don't know what it is it smells like dressing and you know cleaner and you kind of sterile and just, just not a good smell I keep smelling it and it's driving me nuts I'm seriously like I'm gonna kill a bitch best thing to wake up to I was gonna say someone you love, but that's never happened to me, so I can't say that. But I think, I don't know why, I think this is just me and my obsession with my phone, but like waking up and either like waking up to a phone call from someone I want to talk to or I haven't talked to in a while, or like getting a, just a really nice text and waking up to that, I think that's probably the best thing to wake up to, because it's always just really nice. Worst thing to wake up to happened to me this morning, and that would be you know, you're sleeping, it's very nice, it's very calm, and then at about 4.10 in the morning, the fire alarm starts going off because some drunk-ass dumb hole, just moron, I said dumb hole. <laughs> what does that even mean? Some drunk-ass decides to set a fire in the kitchen on the floor above us, and probably thought it was hilarious, set the whole kitchen on fire. Um, definitely the sprinklers in half the building turned on, destroyed a couple of rooms. That's not a good thing to wake up to. By the way, if I ever find out who did that, I will, you know, set them on fire. Hey, Pex a bitch! Musicians. Greatest musician, for me personally, would be Blue October. Which is just because, I don't know, they just amaze me. They blow my mind. Justin Furstenfeld, I swear to God. He's sensational. I don't even understand it. Like... Brian, however the fuck you say his last name, is the most incredible violinist I've ever heard in my life. Like, they're so strange, and they're so unusual, and they sing about some of the craziest shit, and, you know, they still manage to have a really big following, and I think that's a big deal. Like, you know, when you're singing songs about schizophrenia, and, like, imagining killing your wife, and people enjoy it, and think you're a good guy. Like, clearly you're doing something right. Worst musician. And I think that term is used very loosely with this particular person. And I'm about to offend a, about 4 million 13-year-old girls, but I'm gonna have to say Justin Bieber. His voice? Not that good. Because just like he kind of looks like a 13-year-old girl with really short hair, he sings like a 13-year-old girl with really short hair. And he's just, he sings about love, and I want to kick him in the face, because it's like, you're 13, just go jerk off in your room, that doesn't count as love. Sorry, I don't like him. Sorry. I don't know. That's really all I have to say to you guys. You crazy bitches. <laughs> Worst face to make in a vlog. The one I just made. I don't know what the fuck.
Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go before this gets even more mortifying. Um, so, yeah, Justin Bieber, please don't hate me. And if you do, fuck, I could take you in a fight. I don't really care. Um, yeah, I'm gonna roll out of his ear. Right? 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 I'm gonna go, uh, you know, punch myself in the face 50 times because this is terrible.